the HTTP get a lot of information. Those are the HTML script, AJAX, CSS image. Yes, I can click on this if I want to see only the HTML script from the website and click on them and see what is inside and analyze it. Yes, so we have a lot of information. All the script, yes, the JavaScript from the website. You can also click on them and analyze them, get a lot of information. Yes. So the Ajax also, the same things, yes? The CSS, you can click on them and analyze them. Image, yes? We, uh, okay, let, let, let's see where we, okay, this is the image, yes? This is the image. And, and, and PNG, logo, this is the website logo, yes? This is the hash of the logo, yes? So, so what we will do now, the, the, the good things with this tool, you know, is that apart from only checking this, we can do a lot of things, but we went back to it. Let's just first talk about, you know, those menu, yes? So we can go to redirect. Unfortunately, there is no redirection sh uh, 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 shown because sometimes when the website has some link to redirect somewhere, when you click on redirect, you can see it. But this time it's not showing anything, yes? behavior yes we see a lot of information the script you know the information about those you know script and some cookies information and you know a lot of information here shopify the cookie and you know shopify and a lot of information and the cookies and some information about the website so th those information are very important for you also yes those are the indicator all the website the ips and the hashes you know of the website yes so those are also very important information yes you see the the, the the domain you can analyze those if you want similar that's very important those are websites that are, have some kind of correlation with this could be same website or they are all hosted on the same ip address or same asn you see the url yes same IP address, they are hosted somehow on the same IP address and, and same ASN, yes? That's very important because if you want to be sure that this website is malware, it's a malicious website or the IP address behind the website is hosting bad website, so you should not trust this website, you can analyze those website. And the ASN also, that's very important. If you analyze in a website, you need to make a report to your manager, yes? This is how you can get more information. So let's back again, yes? We, we check the similar. DOM, this is the DOM code, yes? So you have a lot of information here, the script and many things. So it can be possible sometimes that you discover even some vulnerability or some you know, a redirection website share a lot of information. You just need to uh, 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 check it, yes? Like if I, HTTP, I can see some information, I can check those websites or some script and a lot of information. In the future, I will give you information where there was, you know, embedded malicious link. And if you click on it, you will be redirected to the malicious website, yes? Or you can click here, post, okay. Post, it's post, post address, post. Okay, I mean the HTTP post I want. HTTP post. Okay, it won't be like this. But if you click on HTTP, you, the post, HTTP post, some, okay, HTTP post in something somewhere probably. I mean, if you go dig, dig, dig like this, you will see those post requests. You will see what is post which information you know credit card information username and stuff we don't see username your password and stuff you know the password maybe is post somewhere another link or another url it depends on the case we are analyzing i'm just giving you some kind of holistic view you know of url scan yeah so this is also something you can make yes and and the content, yeah, the content also content quite information, uh, 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 interesting information. You have those posts, yes, what they're doing, yes, 
So you can analyze those information, check which information are post. Yes, card add and you know you, you have some information there. You can check it. Maybe you can find something. It depends on the case. Yes. So 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 this is also very useful, and the API. I think those might be some type of API used by the website to get some information from other websites somehow. So you can check those. Usually I'm not checking it to be honest, but you can also check it. That can help you to get more information, you know. I mean, it depends on what you are analyzing, yes. But what is quite interesting for me, let, let's back. We were here, yes. So I will open again another dashboard, search. Imagine that I want to find all the websites that have the same logo. That's easy. Logo Kida Ben. If I click on this, I will see any website that have this name mentioned has a logo. The same website or other website, I can see it. So I can, you know, you see, okay, this is the same website because it you are scan only this the same website with this logo. But what if I want to see the hash of the logo? Maybe other websites are using the same hash, not the same logo name, but the same hash. Okay, we check it also, yes? Only this website, yes? So with this this IP or ASN, yes? Let's check it also. Okay, this IP, okay. We see other websites with the same IP, yes? You can analyze those websites also to maybe they are bad or whatever it is, yes? Same ASN, yes? You, you can check it also with your scan, yes? Your scan is a really powerful tool, yes? So, 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 so we, we, we got a lot of information right now, yes? We can check the image, for example, here this is uh, some type of image we, we want to see, we have the hash of this image, we can click on it. We can see all the website with the same hash. Yes, it can be also for the file, the script. Imagine that you want to see other uh, website with this, the name of this script. You can click on it. Yes, or, or this this hash. Yes, if this is a malicious hash, you want to find all your website logo. You want to see other website using your website logo. You can do it. Other website using this. The, the script name it can be the same script name not the same hash name which is different you need to be careful yeah so the same hash yes somehow yes other website using the same hash of the script maybe this script is from the third party this website is also using the, that same script for some reason yes so does it mean it's a bad script or good you need to analyze it depending on your case you can Click on the show and analyze the script. What I, I love to do sometimes, for example, you can click on this. You you you, you can copy this content and put in executable format, or somehow you can download download it and run it in a sandbox to see how this script behave. Yes, that can help you to be sure that this script is a malware or not. You can run it, you know. Up in Iran or various total any any script uh, any sandbox yes so so we got a lot of information now we know that with the search we can check the website yes for example let's show some example yes if I type this yeah now what I see now I see that we 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 we, we get in some information. Maybe let's take another website maybe that can help us to see more information. Let's take this website. I want to, you know, give better explanation. Okay. Here I, I type this website. We can see that, you know, this website was scanned many times, eight days ago, five days ago, two months ago. You, you can expand it to see how it was that time and compared to the way it is right now. That can help you to know a lot of information. And we get this. We might get even sometimes other websites, yes? Not the same name, like, like for example, YouTube. This is a website 
you will understand what I mean soon, yes? So, so we get a lot of information. Okay, this website somehow was redirected into you know YouTube, but why YouTube? Maybe, maybe uh, it has some t t type of code. Uh, okay, it was redirected into YouTube. Uh, uh, when you click on YouTube, it, or you click on this, it redirects you to YouTube for some reason. Yes, that's why we see. So the the good thing here is. If the website, for example, is redirected into other websites, if you type here, you might see those websites here. And like, like, like we did, yes, let's say, click show hint. So show hint can, you know, show other websites, you know, that are used. <coughs> Sorry. Other websites, not the same name, but somehow they also use this website, like this one. Malicious one. Maybe this website is mimicking the website we're checking. That's why I know it's potential malicious. Yeah. So you see this customer. So they're mimicking the website we were checking. You can also click on help. Yes. If you click on help, you have a lot of things here. Yes. Let, let, let's just give a few examples. What we can do. Let's see if it's going to work. Okay, wait, wait, wait. Okay. There was an error executing and regular expression leading. Okay, okay. Wait, wait, wait. I will take something more simple. Okay, let's 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 just take this. Those scripts are very useful because they can help you to do a lot of things. A lot of things. What is happening now? Now we want to find the domain uh, that have somehow the name of PayPal, but not the real PayPal.com. Yes. So which means those domains are mimicking somehow PayPal. Yes. Let, let's close this. Yeah. Okay. Okay. Somehow, somehow we don't see much. PayPal. Okay. This is close, close to what we are looking for. We found out, you know, how we can check those domains and how we can be sure that those domains, you know, are are bad or good one. Yes. So for for now, we will just limit here. We were able to, uh, how to say, check the, the domain. We somehow found out, you know, how to check the domain, how to check your scan, different feature, you know, how you can, you know, you know, analyze different indicator, the hash, the IP, you know, the image, a lot of search you can make here, a lot of search, yeah, you, you can type the IP. You can type a lot of things, you know, like, like I just described it to you. You can check the ASN, you can check the hash in the search, the, the, the file name, for example, you type this, you know, you have the file name, you type the image and a lot of information. If you click on help, you get a lot of information. If you, if you want to get some information, you know, how to check it, you know, feel free to contact me i will be happy to help you or re-watch again the videos okay so it's over for today don't forget to subscribe we just started we will be talking about a lot of tool and show to you how to use the tools and it will be quite interesting and very practical because we will sometimes take live cases and show how we can investigate it so it was austin africa and don't forget to subscribe and see you soon.